honoring the sacrifices of our heroes, our nation's military veterans. It's what our community gathered to do this morning at Metro Park. Our own Dustin Askin was there for the ceremony. He joins us live with the details. Well, from the opening prayer to the bell ringing at the end, the spotlight today was shined on those who preserve and protect the freedoms we Americans so desperately cherish. Representatives from Congressman Steve Daines and Governor Steve Bullock's office were among the speakers. One of the veterans in attendance was Carol Mick. She served in the United States Army and the Naval Reserve. She says veterans get more recognition now than when she served in the late 1970s, well, something that she deeply appreciates. If you see a veteran, say thank you. Because he deserves, he and she deserves it. Not just me. I mean, there's a lot of us have done a lot more than um, we've ever been recognized for. Mick says all humans have a responsibility to each other, and although she says it would be nice if all problems could be solved without war or conflict, she says unfortunately sometimes that's not the case. Later on in the show, we'll have more on the ceremonies held across the nation today, and coming up at 6, we'll hear from a veteran who is also a retired chaplain.